Hi there, welcome back to Fit Friday. I'm Newman Dodderwick, your personal fitness trainer. Today I'm gonna to show you another bench routine that you can do either in the park or in your gym. First, I'm gonna start out doing bench taps, bench hops, and then walking planks using a bench. Thus, a bench series. <laughs> First, let's start out doing the bench taps. You wanna start out with your left or your right leg up, and all you're gonna do is you're gonna replace the foot in which you just had up there on top of the bench. We're going to try and develop some uh, strength in the calves and some stability in the calf or in the ankle joint. All I want you to do is start a little hop, lightly tapping, not stepping up onto the bench, but lightly tapping the bench, alternating your feet right to left. Do a series for about 60 seconds and you'll feel that nice little burn in the calves, but also developing some strength in your hip flexors. Next, with your bench hops, I want you to be able to stand with your feet shoulder width apart. I want you to squat down. And with a counter motion, I want you to be able to hop up onto the bench and then hop down. Hop up, hop down. You get to change the variety of the speed in which you want to actually jump up, and that'll make it a lot harder. The faster you go, the more power you can actually develop in your legs. Hopping up, hopping down. Hopping up, hopping down. Total lower body development. Next, I want you to be able to do walking planks using the bench. If it's, if it's too hard putting your feet up on top of the bench, you can easily do it down on the ground as well. First, just put yourself with your feet on top of the bench, almost in a push-up position with your feet elevated. I want you to slide your left hand over to the left, meet your right hand to the left hand, and walk yourself left to right, kind of like a pendulum. And I want you to just slide your hands in a lateral motion, left to right, constantly keeping your body in a neutral position. And try and go left to right for a series of two to three and that'll develop some stability in your lower back and in your core, as well as some mobility in the shoulder girdle. You can just do right to left two to three times or until you get exhausted. Just make sure you don't feel any kind of discomfort in that lower back. All the meanwhile, you get a full body workout routine with no equipment, just a park, a bench, and a beautiful day outside. And as always, thanks for looking west for your wellness.